And then the last question: What did you think of the judging in the uh, in the uh, co-main event? I mean, it seemed to me I thought your judging tonight was atrocious. Yeah. Felt like I was in a, at a boxing match in Ireland tonight. <clears throat> And I know you just said the judges were atrocious, but what did you make of the Mario Batista Jose Aldo fight? Um, I thought the judging was atrocious tonight. I'll just leave it at that. It was, it was atrocious. Dana, going back to that Aldo fight, you know, in the third round, Mario came out and sort of went for a takedown. Referee separated them, immediately go straight for the takedown again. Do you think the referee could have been more active in quitting them with stalling there? I always think that the referee should be more active on that, 100%, especially when somebody keeps doing it to stall. And. You guys aren't going to fucking let up on this, are you? I guess we'll get into it. Um, if you, I don't know, if you're judging on a guy, whether is it control, if it's this or that, um, if you're not trying to fight, how do you win the fight, right? And if you're looking at attempted takedowns, well, what about stuffing the takedowns? Uh, it just madness. There is a difference between offensive grappling and just wasting time. Hundred percent. And it's not just the referees that need to recognize that, but clearly the judges as well. When you can tell that the guy definitely doesn't want to stand and strike and just wants to stall against the fence, yes, the refs, that's their job. They're supposed to see it. When they see it continually happening and, and, and that the guy is not trying to win the fight, then you keep breaking them up. Do you think Conor McGregor tweeted about his idea for stopping stalling, was introducing a stalling clock, and if you go back to the same move, the clock ticks down, and you let them be in that position for less and less time? Is Maybe not that idea, but would you like to see referees? if they? Yeah, go I don't even think you need a clock. I, I mean, it's common sense. When, when the guy keeps doing it and is doing everything he can to not fight and not win the fight, as a ref, you should break it up immediately. I mean, if he just did it three rounds in a row and keeps doing it, you know, and they get there, he doesn't get the takedown. Give him a couple seconds to see if he gets the takedown, then break it up. 